Liliuokalani was the first queen and last monarch to rule Hawaii. Many of the white businessmen and sugar planters who settled in Hawaii joined together to form something called the Hawaiian League, which imposed a constitution to limit the powers of the Hawaiian king and disenfranchised Asian and native Hawaiian residents of the islands. When Liliuokalani's brother died, she became queen. She was a talented musician and composer who wanted to preserve and protect native Hawaiian culture and to regain powers for herself and Hawaiians under a new constitution. The white settlers saw her as a threat, and in 1893 they overthrew her with the help of United States troops. She was imprisoned in her palace and placed under house arrest. Even when removed from the throne, she continued to be an advocate for Hawaiian rights and culture for the rest of her life. She traveled to Washington to petition the U.S. government not to annex Hawaii, but in 1898, Hawaii became a U.S. territory. Congress did not apologize for the overthrow of the Hawaiian monarchy until 1993, a full hundred years after the fact and 76 years after Liliuokalani had died, the first and last queen of Hawaii.